my dear buddies welcome back to motorcycle university videos so in the previous video we discussed about the crankshaft and the connecting rod of an engine of a motorcycle engine but what does this connecting rod connect to so that it can transfer power to the crankshaft well it connects to this the piston now how many of us have wondered how does a piston look like in real life we've seen them uh, in photographs in google search but we never actually had a look at a real piston so this is out of a ktm duke 200 and this piston connects to this rod that is the reason this is known as a connecting rod because the piston connects to this rod and transfers power to the crankshaft so buddies as i mentioned that there are four strokes in a four stroke engine to generate power and only one stroke actually generates power known as the combustion stroke or the power stroke so when the piston is connected like this to the connecting rod and when it actually goes up and compresses the fuel and air mixture and the spark is ignited that is the time when the power stroke happens and the piston moves down from the cylinder i will show uh, what is the cylinder how does it look like in the next video it moves down with torque and the power from the piston gets transferred to the connecting rod and the power from the connecting rod gets transferred to the crankshaft all right and the piston also has piston rings so that there's a tight seal that is made uh, in between the piston and the cylinder walls which i will show it to you in the next video i'm going to keep this videos quick and easy for you to understand buddies so well so this is the face of the piston okay that is the reason you see a lot of carbon accumulated here okay and uh, this is the side which seals with the cylinder walls seals means it gives a tight uh, you know packing when it moves inside the cylinder and this is the part that connects to the connecting rod here are you guys able to see it so this is the part that connects to the connecting rod like this okay thanks for watching buddies and in this video of motorcycle university we showed you how a piston looks like and what job it does inside your engine in the next video i'm going to show how a bore a cylinder looks like thank you bye bye